Live inside the Lubbock city limits ignored the fireworks ordinance on Sunday is probably an understatement. A lot of bombs bursting in air over the city and KMAX Katie Gray spoke with the folks at emergency service about all that today. Brian, it's understandable to want to see fireworks on the holiday. Despite them being illegal in the city, Lubbock Fire and Rescue had a lot of calls over the holiday. We had a large increase with our call volume during the holiday weekend, which is not uh, unexpected. EMS Training Chief Chad Curry says EMS did see an uptick in calls around the holiday. It increased uh, anywhere between about 20 and 50 calls extra per day. Curry says many of the calls varied relating to fireworks, heat, medical incidences, or drownings. However, Lubbock Fire and Rescue Captain Philip Grannon says that they responded to 814 calls about fireworks, since the end of June. We had extra unit staff just dedicated to going on fireworks calls, but even with that, those extra units, it still stretched our normal emergency staff because they went on, just engines alone, went on 136 calls on July 4th in a short amount of time. It is against the law to set off fireworks in city limits. Captain Grannon says it's not about paying a fine but depleting emergency resources. The number of calls about fireworks delays emergency services to those who may need help. So as a citizen, think about that. That takes away their ability to run to actual emergencies. So if your family member is experiencing something where they need life support of some type, someone's trapped in a car wreck that they had, or you have an actual fire emergency, our response could be delayed because we are dedicated on responding to someone calling in about fireworks. Lubbock Fire and Rescue say many of the calls that they did receive resulted in warnings or fines for people setting off fireworks in their yards.